Okay, everyone, you have one minute to finish your typing. Amanda, where did you learn to type like that? I taught myself in practice at home to get faster. It's a great skill to have. Okay, listen carefully. I need you now to go and find the image of yourself from the network drive. I want you to insert it into your Word document. I want you then to save your Word document as a PDF and then I want you to upload it to the network so you can put it on your digital portfolio. Excellent, terrific. Good luck. Amanda, I have no idea what he's talking about. Which part didn't you understand? The part after, listen carefully. I hate computers. Josie, why do you hate computers? It's not like I hate computers, it's more that they hate me. What do you mean? Ever since I was in prep, I have struggled with computers. I still remember learning to use the keyboard and struggling with one finger, while my friends are typing better than the teacher. But that was five years ago. Haven't you improved your computer skills since then? Yes, a little, but it doesn't really interest me. I'd much rather read a book than read an iPad, and I'm concentrating my efforts on my handwriting, because that is the skill we need most when we do our Year 12 examinations. Actually, Josie, my mum was reading a newspaper article the other day about how some schools are trialling computer-based VCE exams. Hey dear, look here. It says in the paper, Year 12 students will undertake the math methods exam on computer for the first time in a move that could spell the end of handwritten examinations. Ha! Who'd have thought? You mean I may need to use a computer for my Year 12 exams? Not only that, Josie, what job do you want to do in the future? A job that doesn't involve computers. Really? What job doesn't involve computers? I want to be a doctor. Josie, my mum is a doctor and she is never off her computers. She uses her iPad to help diagnose illnesses, her phone to email other doctors, her laptop to look up medical journals and write papers. A computer is an essential tool for a doctor. OK, I won't be a doctor. I'll be a teacher instead. Josie, teachers use computers all the time. They use them for role marking, for lesson preparation, for displaying concepts on screens. Yeah, for researching information, for writing reports and lots of other things. Teachers are always on either desktops, tablets or smartphones doing their work. Josie, you don't need to give up on your dreams. You're only in grade five. You have time to develop your computer skills. It just takes practice. Amanda is right, Josie. You need to open the door. What door? The door to your mind and your attitude, Josie. Developing ICT skills is important for your future. ICT, start here, go anywhere. That's what my parents say.